Hey everyone, how y'all doing today? When I had did the review, first review of the Mini Wireless i8 USB LED keyboard, I forgot to include a good key feature of the keyboard. Now this keyboard also lights up. As you see, I got it turned on. Now, to make it light up, you hit the FN, which is the function, and you hold the F two button you got green let's do it again f2 you got blue function f2 gives you red then hit f2 again it turns it off now let's go to function f2 let's go to green now it also do rgb now to go ahead and activate the rgb you just go ahead on and rub your fingers right across there and you got the keyboard controls as you know it has to go ahead and shut off delay so which is good though because it also saves up on the battery so but go ahead and show you that cool feature right there and you can go ahead and see at night, it's very handheldable. It fits right in the palm of your hand. I love this keyboard. This keyboard is basically used on my uh, entertainment computer in the bedroom. So when I'm in there watching my Hulu and Netflix, I'm also good to go with that. So I can go ahead and see in the dark when there is no light available. Turn off the light. As you see, I got the light turned off. So we're in the dark. It gives you good features like this. So. Now, if you don't want that, just hit F2 again. You get blue. And if you want to go head on and activate the go ahead, activate because you just rub your fingers right across. And it changes colors RGB style. So you can't go wrong with that. This is a good keyboard. I love it. I got it off of New Egg for $11.99, but if you go to Amazon, you can probably get it for $9.99 to about the same price as um, New Egg is $11.99. So, again, it's a good keyboard. You cannot go wrong with it. Um, the features are great. To go ahead and activate whatever color you like, you got green, red, blue. And then you go ahead and turn it off if you don't if you do use it in the daytime. But at nighttime, I like the green. Uh, I love the red and I love the blue. So you can't much go wrong with this. So this is a great keyboard. I'm gonna go ahead and put the um link in my description below. So I can go ahead and purchase this one. If you think it is good, you can also use it on your regular regular home computing. Um, if like we don't want those those big bulky keyboards, if this keyboard fit good for you, you go ahead on and you can use that for that. But once again, to turn the function light on, just hit function and F2 to change, turn it off. Function F2 to turn it on, change colors, green, blue, red. And if you want the RGB full effect, you just go ahead on and... um. As you see, can't go wrong with it. As you see, I'm tapping the key just to keep it on, but it does have its own auto shut off, which is good to go ahead and save up on the battery life. You can't you can't ask for no more for that though. So this is not good. This is this is this is not a bad idea. So this is not a bad idea. And it's, it's very slippery, as you said. I got big hands, so you know I can slip right out your hands if you have big hands. But for but for small hand users, it fit perfectly in the palm of your hand. You can't really go wrong with that. Turn it off. Green, blue, 
Red. You can't go wrong with it. All right, go ahead on and um, subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. And I thank y'all for watching this is short, quick video of the Mini Riders I8 Keyboard Part 2. I'm glad y'all enjoyed it. Y'all have a wonderful, blessed night. And I'll see y'all on the next, next round, next video. Peace.